Hey guys, okay, so I very, very rarely ever do dupe videos, but I wanted to bring one to you. And I have found the perfect dupe for the Anastasia Beverly Hills Nicole Carrera Glow Clip. Now, this is no shade on Anastasia. I would always rather use this one. But unfortunately, this glow kit has been fully discontinued, out of stock for goodness knows how long. We don't know if it's ever going to come back. So this glow kit, which I believe was like $40 or $45, I have found the perfect dupe for Tim. Now this one comes off of Hush, which is a website shophush.com, or you can get the app on iPhone. If you get the app, you get free two to three day shipping on everything you buy. They have a lot of great dupes, a lot of great products. Um, and on your first purchase, you also get a free gift for being a new member. Um, I got an eyebrow razor. Sometimes you can get false lashes. Just depends on what they have in stock. So um, let's just jump right into this and I'll show you how similar these are. Now here's the Anastasia. You open it up. It's a little magnetized. Has these six shades in it. No mirror. <clears throat> now this one's actually a little bit heavier. It's a little silkier on the front. This is what the front of it looks like. It's called the Rose Highlight Collection. It's by Bad Habit. It's a little stronger magnetized. Has six very similar shades. And it has a mirror. There's my camera. Hi guys. So basically what you're getting here is almost the same thing. Now let me see if I can open these up side by side so you can see just how similar these shades are. Okay, pull them back. Basically all they did was switch around the pans because you've got this white one here, this one down here forever lit. You've got these two in the center that are touching each other, almost identical. The middle two are the same. Um, I mean, they're almost exactly the same colors. They look very similar. This one looks a little more glittery, which may just be because I use this Nicole Guerrero kit like every single day. <clears throat> so what I'm gonna do now is get you some finger swatches and show you kinda how they look. It's gonna be, well, I'll just show you. So here's ABH. Okay, so here's the first one. See if it can focus in, they're so shiny. This is Forever Lit in the ABH, and this is Shine in the Rose palette. So then we're gonna go into my personal favorite is Kitty Cat. And it's a really nice kind of rose gold color. And the dupe for it is hashtag all day. We're just gonna put those side by side. And if you can see, they're right here. This is the ABH and this is the Rose. They're almost identical. So you can see it better from this angle. I mean, they're just about the same. So then we'll try Forever Young out of ABH next to Cheers from the Rose palette. These are a teeny bit different, but I mean, they're they're almost the same exact color. And I'm sorry, my swatch game is terrible. Um, now I'm gonna try this one kind of on my hand. It looks like there may be a little bit of difference. Uh, champagne looks like Glow Getter. Bubbly's one for three. Pinky's up looks like Daydream. Hashtag all day looks like kitty cat and shine looks like forever lit. And I will put that in the description so that if you get this rose palette and you want to follow along, you can do that. If you know that this one certain color out of ABH is already your favorite or it looks like it would be, you can do it that way. <clears throat> so what I'm gonna do now is I have two brushes that have very similar ends. They're both very soft. Neither has ever been used. I'm gonna go in with Kitty Cat, because like I said, it is my favorite, and I'm gonna put ABH over here and Rosé over here, and we're gonna see how much difference we can tell. So here is the ABH, and I'm gonna try to really pack this on on both sides. 
just so that you can see a very blinding effect. Okay, now the one over here is going to be the hashtag all day. And this is actually the first time that I have fully dipped into this palette. I did open it and check it out and compare Forever Lit and Shine because those are the two obvious ones that are exactly the same. So here's the rose. And honestly, like this is ABH and this is the rose. So considering one, you cannot get this Anastasia Beverly Hills palette anymore. Sucks. Two. Honestly, this one is far more blinding in my personal opinion. It's just as creamy. The colors are identical. I'm not big on dupes, but even if the ABH was still available, if you're on a budget, this rose palette is going to save you like 30 plus dollars. Plus you get the free shipping if you use Hush. So what I'm going to do now is just give you all one final look. <clears throat> And I'm also going to go ahead and go in with this rosé palette and I'm just going to do my face with it because I do love how blinding this is and because I want to give it an all day wear test if I have any issues I will put them in the comments so that y'all can know if it wears good if I'm still blinding by the end of the day <clears throat> and I'm going to take cheers because it's more of a tan color and I'm going to put it on my nose. Um, Cheers is this top one right here. And then I'm going to take champagne right there. And put this on my Cupid's bow because I feel like this gold complements my brown lip really well. And of course, like I always do with almost all my eye looks, I'm going to take this white one, which in this case is called Shine. And I'm just going to get a little bit on my fingertip and pop this into my inner corner to finish up my eye look. And take a tiny bit and pack it on top of the brighter color I have in the inside of my eye just to give it that extra shine and I just think that if you are looking for a good highlight palette you have an iPhone which you can order it on your computer or your Android just through the website but it's gonna be $4.95 shipping so if you can get a hold of an iPhone and you can get the hush app I mean this is like a solid highlight palette I really like it I recommend it and I hope y'all try it out if you already have. Let me know in the comments what you thought about it. And let me know what other dupes you would like to see. I will have the famous Aphrodite off of Hush. If you're on there, you know what I'm talking about. It will be coming up soon. It's actually coming in the mail today. It just didn't come in time for me to film before I have to go out of town. So it'll be up probably sometime next week. If you have any other suggestions or if you want to see any other dupes, if this is something you would enjoy, let me know. Thanks, guys.